and this is the coast. If you look behind me, you can see how dangerous it can be and the, the wonders and the, the havoc it can wreak on Earth. Imagine what it did to poor John Davies. I'm actually nearly three metres away, a bit further from, from the place where John's accident happened. This very swift that took so cruelly what John needed and left deficit in his life. You can see the waves flashing into the boat and you can assure you that this is a force to be reckoned. Years later we catch up with John and we, he tells us the devastating story and we see how it's affected him. Finally, John Davies was ready to speak. I'm Morgan Steele and this is Planet Earth! Yeah, so we uh, walk back past the, uh, the shops. Kieran, the local beggar, was there at the time. So I reached into my upper left pocket uh, where I keep my change when I'm when I'm not dressed up. You know, offered offered the man some change. <laughs> spirits with that and you know it so I uh, held back anyway and uh, I always do what Roy says you see Hi I'm, I'm Kieran Pecker, local beggar I remember the day of the accident um, Ro um, Roy told uh, John not to give me any money I was gonna have lots of coin in my, in my hat but I didn't have any at the end of the day because Roy told me everyone to put up a sign not to give me money and I, he said I'd buy spirit which I would have that day if that's because it was St Patrick's Day and I, I just wanted to fun but I, I can't believe it, it's a bad accident isn't it? <laughs>
John left me, uh, I was quite angry with him for leaving me. I couldn't believe that he'd actually just gone off, disobeyed one of my commands. And this turned out to be a very big command, a big one that he should have obeyed and that would have probably saved him from this accident, definitely. But because I told him to stay right by my side, uh, right by my side, right by my side, and uh, he, he went off. I couldn't believe it, and I, I was so angry with him that I don't, I don't, I can't believe to this day, I don't know why I did it, but I went home, walked all the way back to my house because I was so angry with him walking away from me like that. I, I, could, I don't know what, I was just fuming, fuming with anger and the sea was really fierce as well I think that's part of my anger maybe somewhere in there and uh, so I left I left David at uh, Rock and uh, went home right back to my house and uh, yeah